Welcome back guys, so Rank Cups are back in the game again. If you have played last two seasons, you would know about Rank Cups. Basically, it's a, another means to increase your overall. Of course, it doesn't change any stats. We need to get uh, Rank Tokens. This year, it's called as Shards. Uh, we need to get these Shards and then using those, we can do Rank Cups. Here, the, we can get some of these shards by completing these paths and then doing the SBCs. Uh, this one requires uh, players from this uh, Dutch league uh, at a DBZ and this one requires Italian players but yeah I did not uh, know I mean none of us would know right <laughs> unless we are developers we won't know that we would not need these players so I did not have enough uh, of these so I'm not able to complete this right now because right now the price is just uh, over the roof just uh, just too much anyway there is it like we have like a 14 days time to do this so I'm hoping that by then maybe the global team of the week would have some players in the desk league or some Italian players and all which would make it a bit easier and even the price in the market I'm guessing that everyone would be doing it now and slowly maybe after a week it would uh, come down I'd be doing uh, those now for now I managed to get like 20 points to get the first set of shards uh, the card looks crazy good first time in FIFA mobile of course the Chinese version had this thing but first time in FIFA mobile we're having cards uh, with more than 100 overall but i'm not a fan of it uh, i mean the card is amazing i would i would love to get that one but i think i will get this one maybe who knows uh, three months later i have no idea but the thing is uh, training after 100 it costs uh, too much coins and xp and all anyway guys uh, and it doesn't even change the stats so I'm going to just get these common uh, shards. Okay. And using these common shards, we can level up our players. So the first level, first level up. The Easter event has um, an SBZ as well that gives us some of the shards needed. Uh, common and rare shards both. But even that SBZ, I'm not doing right now. Because it, re it requires Easter event players and it's kind of uh, crazy prizes right now. Okay. Coming back here. We can see for 100 to 101, it's 1.8 million XP. That's a lot of XP for uh, no benefit. Okay, so you need 5 shards and 78 overall player for doing one rank up. So that's a, that's a good thing. I mean... It's only asking for a 78 and it only costs uh, 10,000 coins to do rank ups. Last year it was like, I don't know, 1 million or 1.5 million coins and you needed uh, masters like 90 plus writer players for doing uh, rank ups. But the negative aspect of this one would be that last season it was like, I don't know, 3 ranks, 4 ranks, up to that much only. It was available but this season... I have a, a feeling that we might uh, we might end up seeing a crazy crazy overalls okay so second one also we can do with common shards alone uh, okay first we will do the first ranks uh, for one okay once we do you can see next overall is one by five ranks we are done we need to do four more once we do four more ranks, then we can uh, get a rank up. So yeah, let's go ahead and do a rank up. Again, five common shards and we throw in a 78 trader card. Due to these rank ups, the praise of all the 78 traded cards have gone up like crazy as well. But yeah, we can still snipe some of those global team of the week cards and that seems to be the way to go, at least for now. Okay, third one, once we do five of these, we can uh, complete one set. 
Rank up seem to be less costly than last season, even though you need uh, five ranks for it. But yeah, the right now it seems like there's a lot of stuff in the game with uh, Nesta and Hazard and all that would require a lot of time in getting. Okay, another rank here. Okay, Petit. Okay, I'm going to throw in him. And the next rank, uh, from next rank, we will need an elite or an 80 rated player. So yeah, it's, I mean, it's amazing for uh, those who have invested in players. I haven't done too much, but yeah, it should be fine with time, I'm guessing. Easter event is not giving too much players, but other than that, uh, should be all right. Okay, and the rank, we can do rank transfers. It is uh, much different than how it was in previous seasons. We will talk about that one later. First, uh, we'll just do the rank ups. Once we do like uh, 10 rank ups, then we can gain uh, two overalls. But yeah, five rank ups. You can see guys here, uh, the chemistry view. Okay, the information tab, uh, that's the one. here you can see that I have five overall points five rank uh, ranks now and and Ronaldo Perit Pjanic uh, Zidane and Ramos and that gives me a plus one overall right now I cannot do more rank ups but yeah I'm guessing that once the praise of these Easter plays come down a bit in market here we need to have four exact 86 plus overall players and a couple of them has to be Easter players. The other 86 plus I have already bought and they can still be sniped uh, kind of cheap but the Easter ones are right now because everybody is buying them for doing this particular SBC so they are a bit uh, costly. So yeah we I, I would suggest to wait a bit and maybe snipe them. So guys, rank ups is uh, pretty simple this season and looks uh, kind of cheaper as well. And guys, now let's see how rank transfers work this season. In previous seasons, rank transfers basically meant losing that player and the rank and the overall also uh, used to transfer to the next player. And in previous season, we had to train players to 100 to do rank ups and then we use a hundred rater ranked up player as xp for another player then that second player used to get the rank up uh, and the overall from the main player but this time around it is uh, different uh, so just for showing that i got this uh, murillo i trained him up i mean i ranked him up and now i'm going to transfer his rank to bernucci I will not lose either of the players so that is one good addition in my opinion because say you have a rental players and all players you don't want to melt yet like maybe some higher rated players that you want to keep in that case you can still rank them up and when it's not needed when it's the time to change that player you can simply do the rank transfer like if I want to use Petit for the Nesta SBC, the Prime Icon Nesta SBC, I can simply transfer the rank from Petit to another player that I want to use. So guys, uh, it's a pretty nice feature in my opinion. Of course, the Easter event looks good as well, but doesn't look like it has as many players like the other events had. But if you have watched my last video, I was telling you guys, maybe to wait a bit to see what the Easter players what uh, kind of players Easter would bring for doing some of those SBZs and guys it is an 88 rated striker from the hero Indian Super League he could be very much uh, useful for the current icon SBCs and another one from Hyundai A League these uh, were a couple of leagues that were uh, like super costly for doing the icon SBCs so that can be done and the hazard ones and all right now it's a bit costly because 
we did not know in advance but from it lasts for two weeks and we can do it within two weeks i hope and we can look at the patterns and all and hopefully we can prepare for how it would come after two weeks thanks for watching guys bye bye and have fun